Here you hear you, this is Lord Potato and this is part five of What If Naruto was the grand the, I mean the son of Mara, the grandson of Hashirama, and the reincarnation for Ashra and uh, Endera Part five. Also this is my like take three because the first one I had like an ad. Then my second one I accidentally fucking press uh stop recording and then um uh, yeah this is my third one. For fuck's sake. Uh, so I'm kind of still tired. Well, I'm still very fucking tired. So I had to do some things today. So yeah. And yeah. Alright, I got something. Okay, so the last thing that we left... Well, I left off was at... Where Nart... Well, where Madara and Itachi just beat the fuck out of Orchimaru. Orchimaru could not give his... Uh, Hero stuff to Sasuke or Naruto. Even if he did give it to Naruto, Naruto has the nine tail, so get fucked. And if he gives it to Sasuke, well, Naruto can probably just take it off or steal it away or let the nine tails eat the uh, chakra away. Eat like the curse mark away. So, yeah. <sighs> okay, so, so they got to the. To the tower and now is the preliminary rounds okay so it's Gaara versus Rock Lee still uh, Sasuke versus that one sound ninja um, Hinata versus Naji Hana versus another sound ninja or yeah a sound ninja Naruto versus Conquer bro yes <laughs> And, um, of course, they didn't met the sound ninjas, so three down ninjas, so since Sasuke didn't have the curse mark. So, yeah. And so, um, Miko Uchiha, she's going against, uh, Kim. And so, yeah. And, yeah. Um, so, say Hana Uchiha is going in the other, what's it called, the one with, like, the bandages. That covers one eye and then the other eye is open. Yeah, that one. The one does like when you when he hits you, well he doesn't hit you, uh, sounds and you bleed from the ears. Yeah, that one. She's going against that one. So yeah. And Sasuke goes against that one sound ninja. I forgot what was her name again, and I don't remember who the fuck he was going against. How the fuck did I forget him? And yeah, I'm just gonna say that Sasuke won because he doesn't have a curse mark. What fucking convenient. Uh, Hinata. No, wait, it's Miko versus Kim. And Miko uses a fireball. And Kim managed to dodge. I don't remember if Kim was fucking useful. But I know she was probably useful more than Sasuke. So yeah. Um. She's trying to defeat uh, Miko Uchiha, but she can't because Miko has so much skill and so much better for her shotgun gun and easily beating uh, Kim easily. Like punch to the gut, uppercut, then elbow to the gut again, and then full on just grabs her arm, twisting it, and then throwing her out of the arena into the wall and then... So uh, the proctor say, Miko Jiha win. And Miko was like, yay! Uh, oh my goodness, why the hell did I do that? Uh, he said, yay! And um, then uh, Naruto goes up to her and says, congratulations, Miko Jiha. But before even saying uh, Miko, Miko just, just decides to go full on kiss him. And Naruto is blushing. He's like, what the fuck? Uh, Madara's up there just, uh, looking at his son, just getting kissed while him saying, even saying a single word. And he and his son just go on, just go on full on red. Like, just, just like red. And Madara's just chuckling himself. <laughs> uh, uh, what's it called? Itachi's kind of laughing also. Kakashi's like, Perverted minds. Because he saw that he was like, 
for better minds starts bleeding again. Obito, having his shining gun open, I mean, activated and looking at Kakashi, he's like, Kakashi, what the fuck are you looking at? And also, why are you bleeding from the nose again? And uh, Kakashi said, oh, oh you, you can, yeah, fuck. turn off the shotting gun already. <laughs> Obito said, fuck no. I ain't letting you touch my little brother's or his girlfriend, you prick. You fucking weirdo. And Kakashi's like, I'm, no, I'm not thinking of any of that, no. <laughs> and Rin was like, Kakashi, what are you thinking about? And uh, Kakashi's like, nothing. No, no, no. Obito, calm the fuck down. I am not thinking of anything. There was no blood in my nose or anything. Obito fucking wins really fast. Grabbed his mask and pull it down. And you see this, like, like, the, um, like if there was blood there. Like, near his nose. And, um, Ren and Obito. And even, um, what's it called? Uh, that one girl. Uh, the one, uh, Jonin. Uh, fuck. Why the fuck did I forget her name? And I forgot the other one. Oh, shit. But my guy was there, and uh, he looks at Kakashi. He's like, uh, Kakashi, you're kind of bleeding from the nose. And uh, Kurnai. Yeah, Kurnai. She looks at Kakashi, and she's like, you fucking perverted. And <laughs> what's it called? Asuma. I think that was his name. Asuma just looks at Kakashi. She's like, you could not hold it in, Kakashi. Could you, could you, could you not think of this stuff? And Kakashi's like, Fuck all of y'all. I wasn't thinking of anything. There's nothing in my nose. And, um, Obito's like. He just looks at Kakashi with a death glare like, I'm about to murder your ass. Kakashi's like, Bring it, Obito. You ain't gonna defeat me. Even if you could face through me and kick my ass. No matter what, you cannot kick my ass. So, yeah, that, that was just like a funny, mo uh, funny moment there. I just thought it would be hilarious. And, of course, um, Minko, uh, Minko Uchiha, she's getting deep tongue with, um, with, uh, Naruto, and Naruto, just like, mm, 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 just looking at his brother, he's like, mm, mm, mm. And he can't, he isn't trying to be fucking rude, so that's why he's not, like, pushing her away. He doesn't know what to do. He's like, what is going on? And Ahano and Chiho like, uh, Minko, Chiha, uh, Minko, oh, I think you gotta, I think you gotta let him breathe. And Minko was like, oh, I'm sorry, Naruto. And Naruto was like, what the fuck happened? Why am I so red? Why is he eating up? I feel like I'm gonna pass the fuck out. <laughs> oh, Sasuke is like, so, Naruto, how, how was your first time? And, uh, Naruto looks at Sasuke is like, first time of what? <laughs> what was I supposed to do? And Sasuke is like, you can't be this dumb, Naruto. And Naruto say, it's not like it's your first time. Um, It's not like even if you got your first time from Hinata, though. Did you? Because Sasuke is like, fuck you, Naruto. I haven't got it, but... You know, it's moving, it's moving smooth. That's what he said to Naruto. Naruto said... Kind of moving way too smooth, but it's moving way too slow. And Sasuke just like, oh, fuck you. And as so I said, Sasuke's match next. And so, wait, no, I passed Sasuke. It's now Hana's match with one of the sound engines. And the sound engine does put sound in her ear and all that. <laughs> Hana does bleed a little bit. But she had enough of this. So she does a fireball that is at least... um. A rank. Fireball. Um fuck what do I what the what the fuck do I wanna give her? No way. A water style. And she she does like the second Hokage stuff and she does water style. Water dragon. Out of and nowhere. And uh what's it called? Dosu or whatever his name was? I think that was his name. Just looks at it and he's like Please have mercy. And Hano was like, fuck that. Fuck you and fuck your life. And pfft. now she is like impressed. Mm. I'm very impressed with this girl. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes. Also, he's kind of like blushing a little bit. Neji. And also, he kind of have a little drip of uh, blood. Uh, no one saw this except for Kashi and um, Kakashi. 
Not trying to have any perver a perverted mind, uh, perverted thoughts. He's just like, Hugo, Hugo makes me, I mean, not not like me, Uchiha. Pure blood. Non pure blood. Hmm, he was thinking. He like put his eye, like, at the corner of his eye, just thinking and all that. And then, Oito just came behind him. Not Obito, uh, Kuranai. She came, he came behind her, and she said, eh, and Kakashi's looking at Naji and looking at the, uh, Hana, and Kuranai is like, I don't know what the fuck you thinking about, oh, hell no, <laughs> punches him in the head, oh, what the fuck, he's like, are you seriously, what, 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 I didn't think of anything dirty, no, he's like, but I saw you looking at two kids, pervert. And uh, Kakashi's like, no, that that wasn't my intention. No, no, no. Kurt, I don't don't tell Obito. I feel like he's gonna kick my ass again. Well, not Obito. He's like, don't tell Ren. She would not be. She would be so. Uh, so uh, disgraced by me. Uh, Madara is just kind of chuckling. He's like, ah, oh, Kakashi, you moron. <laughs> he's like, uh, uh what's it called? Uh, Itachi's like, oh, I got them in Kakashi. Uh, Sasuke is like, well, we don't know any of these, like, older adults, what they're doing and talking about. And, um, no, Kurt and I said, uh, I'm gonna tell, uh, Kushina and, uh, and Kakashi said, don't tell Kushina, don't! <laughs> no, because he already knows. If you was already having a bleed nose with Naruto and uh, his GF, and he, if she, if any of them told uh, Kushina, Kushina would have found Itachi's house and blow that shit straight high with Kakashi in it taped to his like, door. So, uh, Kakashi said, don't do it. No, no, don't do it. He's trying, he's just begging Kurnai. And uh, Asuma is like, what the fuck? Uh, uh, also, uh, what's it called? Anka was there, and she's just looking at Kakashi, she's like, Hey, Kakashi, what the fuck are you doing? Like, Kakashi's kind of down, he's like, uh, Uncle's like, Are you okay, Kakashi? You know, it's very not. I'm trying to think of a pun, but I can't think of any. And so, she just tried to make a snake joke and all that. And uh, Kakashi's like, not now, uncle. I'm about to get murdered by Kushina. And uncle said, wait, why are you going to get murdered by Kushina? Um, Obito came up and said, well, uh, there's a good chance that Maru isn't going to murder you, but uh, Kushina will. And uh, Kakashi says, oh, thank God Maru wasn't going to murder the shit of Kushina. I fear. <laughs> so yeah, that's what's happening. And, um, what's it called? So, I forgot to mention who is, uh, no, no, not that. Um, what's it called? So, after the whole match where, like, Hana defeating Don Doso very easily, I mean, almost said Donzo, but Doso. Donzo does not really give a shit about the whole Uchiha's or anything. He just looks at them, doesn't care. He doesn't actually think of killing them. He doesn't even have that whole uh, wood arm with like shining guns. And he doesn't have Shinshui's eye. Uh, Cause Shinshui is alive here! Yay! So yeah, Shinshui is like doing a mission right now, so that's why he's not here. But yeah. Um. It's a car. So next is Naruto versus. Who did it? Oh, Kankuro! And when they said. Nor Conqueror, uh, whatever his fucking last name was, I forgot. Conqueror gets down and like, so who am I fighting? Hmm, who am I fighting? And then they say, Naruto Uzumaki! And the and Naruto just comes down. Also, I want to say one thing. His hair is similar to Madara's hair with red. That's why I forgot to mention with Naruto. He has, like, a little bit, like, longer, not long enough. But he doesn't have like this original hair color. Uh, that chip. <laughs> oh, wait. 
Okay, so I want to say, like, it's, like, right to his, like, neck. Not all the way down Naruto's hair. It's, like, right to his neck and all that. So he has similar hair like that with, like, red, uh, like, highlights around and all that. So when Kankuro saw uh, Naruto, he's like, oh, shit, he's going to about to fuck me up. And Naruto said, ah, I remember you. You remember me, Kankuro? And Kankuro was like, no. Also, Tamari, uh, yeah, Tamari, she kind of went up ahead and all that. She was the lucky one instead of Conqueror. So, um, no, Tamari had it to go against Tenten. And, uh, there's actually Rock Lee was going against, uh, Gara. So, yeah, that happens, but less gruesome. Wait. So, actually, with Naruto. And Naruto's like, oh, it's gonna be a nice time to beat the fuck out of you. And uh, Kankuro was like, before he before he raised his hand and was about to speak, Naruto speed blitz him, grab his arm, push him down, and then punch him in the face, knocking him out before he, not not knocking him out, but pushing him away before even saying anything, like punch him straight in the mouth. And and <laughs> Kankuro can't just be like, I'm trying to forfeit. Why the fuck you won't let me forfeit? Naruto's like. Don't worry, Conqueror. It won't. It, it doesn't need to be happening. Don't worry, Conqueror. You're in good hands. Good hands. Like Naruto just has his like bloodless, and he activates his like internal Sharingans. So yeah, he activate both on his both eyes, <clears throat> and so he looks at Conqueror dead eyes, and Conqueror's like, oh, those are the Sharingans. He tried to raise the other hand because the hand that he wanted to raise is like left hand. Yeah, that's fucking like, how should I say? Like, twisted. Like, he just, Naruto, like, fucking twisted that arm. No, not twisted. Broke his arm. So, of course, he can't use his, like, left arm. And he's a puppet dude, so he can't use his left arm for puppets. So he's fucked. He's trying to forfeit. He's like, he tried to use his other hand. Now, nah, Naruto broke that arm also. He's like, stop trying to forfeit, Conqueror. You know, it's fun torturing someone. And, and Conqueror's like, please stop. And the uh, guy was like, he looks at Maru and Maru just says, oh. Uh, then he said, son, please stop, uh, stop torturing the poor kid. And uh, Naruto said, oh, uh, okay. And so Naruto was like, fine, I'll stop torturing him. Let me use a little bit of some power. And he put some, like, Susano on, on his, like, arm and all that. He can put it. And Conqueror just sees this, like, blue, like, skeletal arm in, like, black. And Naruto just punches him in the stomach through the wall. Yes, he punched him at the wall, then it went through the wall, and he flew out. And of course, he touched ahead of the speed over there and grabbed Conqueror and put him back. Yes, that's how powerful Naruto punched him. He touched was like, Naruto, can you please not punch him that hard through the wall? So you just have a marking of Conqueror's outline through the wall. And, uh, what's it called? Uh, Garo's like, well... There goes brother. And Tawar's like, thank God I didn't go against him. And, uh, yeah. So, Conqueror's knocked the fuck out and needs to be in the hospital for like 10 months. No, I'm just kidding, but seriously. You truly fucking hurt. Naruto did not hold anything back. He, he wanted to torture Conqueror. Mentally and physically. But Madara, his father, didn't want to let that happen, so no. Even how the Kazakage is dead. But yeah. That's why Senshui went to the Kazakage, found out he was dead, and so he went back and told Madara. And says, okay, so Ochimaru did it. So yeah, that's what's happening. Naruto was so close just to just just wanted to torture him. He was about to use the Tsukiyomi because uh since he's the son of Madara, he can do Tsukiyomi. He can also do uh 
he can actually be do a better Tsukiyomi than his father since like say he can do an infamous Tsukiyomi but just a smaller skill version but the power of it is still pretty fucking big but this instead of having like a dream you have a fucking nightmare you, you just be scarred forever so yeah that's one of his powers um his other power I, I love this because I usually did give him this and some other ones. So, Zagri, I don't know what kind of abilities you want to want to give Naruto with his internal um, shotting gun that a Madara and Sasuke fuse, fusion internals. So, I don't know which ones you want to give him. If you want to give the same for Sasuke's internal shotting guns, I mean, internal shotting guns abilities and like Madara's shotting gun abilities. But I'm doing an upgrade version from Madara's. Yeah. Where he puts you in the. I mean,. Yeah. So, yeah. You know what? Uh, Madara decided to put the, everyone in the face of Kiyomi. Yeah, it's similar than that to just smaller degree to uh, Naruto. Just to put everyone in someone that he looks into. Into a straight nightmare of just fear and terror in this man. Which just starts screaming out. It's anyone that looks into this eyes. And he puts them in the Genji. They, they will just start screaming and saying, please stop. And, of course, he's just screaming. You don't hear the uh, words or anything. Because they're in their mind. And they just just have terrible nightmares. And then that's when they just decide to uh, stop. They just give up. He was trying to do that. But Maura already knew what he was trying to do. So, yeah. He said, just finish this off, son. <clears throat> also, another ability I want to give him is called... Uh, Darkness or shadow and manipulation, which is darkness and shadow manipulation, which he can control shadows and darkness. Not like the uh, not like Sh uh, Shikamaru can do. No, no, it's completely different. Uh, 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 sorry, sorry. I know I yawn in almost all my videos because I'm tired. I'm a very tired person. Like, my teacher just just be like, how's every one day I be like, I'm tired. And she'd be like, say another word in tired. And I said, cansado. <laughs> and she's like, fuck off. <laughs> Which she doesn't tell me to F off, but yeah. She just looks at me disappointed. Like, why don't you ever go to sleep? And I say, I do go to sleep. I just need more rest than me waking up at 6 o'clock in the fucking morning. Yeah, it fucking sucks. But enough about me. So yeah, Naruto. It's one of those abilities of Darkness Shadow Manipulation. And yeah. Uh, Zagari, I don't know if you want more abilities. Because I'm thinking of more abilities to give him. Because. Yeah. And um. Hmm. Okay. So yeah. He does have Susano. Uh, of course, you can control the Susano either to be in the avatar stage or on his, like, arms, hands, body, and all that. Or just bring up the swords and all that. But, yeah. Also, Zagri, I don't know if you want, uh, what's it called, Naruto Susano to have the swords of Madara and the, so uh, the sword of Sasuke, the similar to the same, and the crossbow. I think that was the crossbow or bow. Mixed together to have it for Naruto. I don't know if you want that. But yeah, I'm giving you a TS. Or if you don't want it and you want something else. Yeah. You can you can comment down the, on the comments and all that. And also. Oh, what's it called? Hmm. Oh, yeah. And also, uh, if you want it. Just wait, 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 wait. Hmm. What was I going to say? Oh, yeah. So, also comment the abilities of what you want for Naruto to have. Also, Naruto has Amaterasu. But just, he has black and white flames. Because I fucking like the black and white flames. Because, fuck it. Why not? It's it's just like, fuck it. Why not? So, yeah. That's his Amaterasu. And, um. Kamowood can't be a thing. Even how I usually give Naruto to Kamui because that's just something broken. I don't know, Zagari, if you want a Kamui and all that. 
But those are just my three special abilities. You can comment more if you want this to have more abilities. But yeah, those are just the three army four with the Susano counts. And so yeah, you, you can comment more. I don't care how many abilities you want him to have. And if it's more than like 10. I actually don't, I don't care. I will probably just minimize each of those probably. I'm gonna probably have to write every ability you want to ask me for, but yeah, I forgot to tell you that if you wanted him to have abilities for his shotgun, gun, fuck. So yeah, back to the story after me rambling off with abilities of Naruto. Yes, <laughs> Zagre did not tell me anything about his abilities for his shotgun. gun. <sighs> Whatever. And also tell me for his Renegade abilities. Yeah. When he hit that thing. Dang. Enemy Kings put another video and Dang. Fuck. I really wanna go watch it, but I have to finish this. I gotta be in track. Or not get sidetracked, but on track with this video. Yeah. Sorry about that. Um, so yeah, Naruto is just like, I wanted to torture Konkuro a little bit more. Why, Dad? Why? And Maru's like, son, I know you wanted to torture him bad, but no. So next is Gara versus Rock Lee. And same thing happens, but less like, instead of fucking his legs up, uh, Gara just doesn't does that. He's actually less insane. So yeah, that's what happens. And yeah. Hmm. Um. Oh, before that even happened, um, Miko just congratulating uh Naruto and Naruto says thanks. But before even saying thanks, uh Miko just kissed him again. <laughs> and Sasuke is getting jealous and jealous more because he can't just have one kiss from Hinata. But, yeah, he's like, oh my fucking days. And Kakashi kind of looks at them again. And before even looking them at them fully, Obito fully kicks him in the fucking face. Knocking him, like pushing him back. And Uncle almost like get hit by Kakashi's body. But she kind of sidestepped and Kakashi's now on the ground. He's like, Ugh. He's kind of twitching and all that. And Obito is like, don't you fucking look at them. Pick <laughs> she's like, oh, it'll be tough. It'll be tough, big brother. Yeah, big brother. I usually, ever, if I ever want it, I always make either Obito like the big brother, or, like at least a father and all that. But yeah, I'm, yeah, this is what uh, Obito is, big brother. Even how he's not even related to even a close of blood to <clears throat> what's it called? Um, Madara, Kushina, or Naruto. I mean, except for the Jiha thing, but yeah, you get that. <clears throat> um, call. Uh, so yeah, that's what happens. And uh, Kakashi just can't have a break. He's like, oh my days. And Naruto, he gets it now. So they basically kind of go intimate, but nothing happens. Just kissing. They just kiss. Nothing else happens, okay? They're just kids. That's what just happens. <clears throat> Zagri, I know they're just kids. I'm not making them any more weirder than this, okay? So, yeah. Um, hmm. Hmm. So yeah, that happens, and uh, so we, when uh, Rock Lee kind of rushes uh, Gara, Gara wins, cause yeah, he's a less insane and all that, and so yeah, that happens. <clears throat> Shikaku's angry, he's like, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, ah, he's trying to control Gara, but he can't, like, son of a bitch. Oh, 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 
So, oh. So, yeah, that happened. And, um. What's it called? Hmm. So, a bunch of things happen. Eno and Sasuke happens. And, uh, Eno just won. I, I just gotta say, Eno fucking won, okay? Yeah, so Eno fucking won, and done. 10 10 loss. Rock Lee loss. Naji versus Hinata. Naji doesn't hate Hinata anymore because he has that Takna Juicy by uh, Naruto and sworn if anything happens to you and get the ca cage bird mark again, I'll probably murder the whole upper and all that. So, yeah. That's his Takna Juicy. And Naji was like, true. <clears throat> So he attacks Hinata, and Hinata does also train with her, like, um, Hugo styles and all that. And when, like, they're doing it, uh, Hinata managed to knock out Naji's, uh, arm out of condition and all that. But Naji just does it with one arm and managed to beat, uh, Hinata, doing 32, uh, pongs. 32, uh, chakra pong points out and of course he didn't kill her and Hinata just says like, uh and um she stopped and all that and um so uh Hinata lost and that she won and when he got up and he tried to go his team Hana was over over there with him and just like Hana kinda jumped on uh Naji and said you won and uh, Naji was blushing a little bit more harder. He's like, mmm, mmm. Tenten is getting jealous because Hana's over here just hugging him. And Naji's like, mmm, mmm, mmm. <laughs> like, he's kind of enjoying it though. At the same time, like, yes, I, love, I like this a lot. And, uh, Kakashi looks up and he sees it like, huh, interesting. And of course, before even doing anything, um, damn it, Kurnai, um, just like kicks him in his head in the ground. <laughs> and Kakashi can't have a break because Obito, Kurnai are just both beating his ass straight to the ground. Any perverted thoughts? And even when uh, Kakashi just wanted to pull out his book, Obito took it and he says, If you dare even read this in front of the kids, I will burn every single last chapter of it you have. And Kurna was like, I can help with that. And um, oh, and Kakashi's like, No, don't do it. Don't, don't, don't burn them all. Of course, Obito is dating uh, Rin. But Kurnai is also dating. Well, not dating. Um. Awesome. No, awesome. Uh, no, they're not dating right now. But since Hinata lost, uh, lost, uh, awesome. I guess to date, uh, Kurnai. And yeah. But Obito and Kurnai are, like becoming good friends and just beating up Kakashi with his perverted minds. He's like, yeah. And Anko is kind of just giggling and laughing every time Kakashi just gets smacked down. And, uh, Kakashi's like, why are you laughing? And, uh, and Anko's like, well, can I not laugh when you get hurt? And he says, no. And, uh, Anko's like, oh, well, sorry. And so, yeah, that's happened. And, uh, what's it called? So, uh, yeah. When, uh, Hinata lost and all that, uh, Sasuke just hugs her. Just be like, it's okay, Hinata. You did your best and all that. And Hinata just blushes. And, um, yeah. And when Kakashi woke up and he says, 
Huh, Sasuke and uh, Hinata. Huh, interesting. Sai, of course, he just defeated one sound ninja, and that was Kabuto. Yes, Kabuto was about to leave, but Sai, this was just an offense battle. Of course, some of the Ambus, root Ambus were about to just take out uh, Kabuto, but Sai was like, hey, where are you going? And Kabuto's like, oh, I'm just going somewhere. And before even saying nothing, Sai just lashes at Kabuto, slashing him. Of course, it's just a giant cut on, like, his chest. And Kabuto's like, so you're just attacking a leaf shinobi, huh? So he does it, like, um, scuffles or whatever. Like, fucking loot shock runs his hand from another. And started to attack Sai. But Sai is kind of skillful. He draws himself... And uh, Sai, uh, not Sai, uh, Kabuto just slashed through them, and he gets hit in his arm. And then a, a bird, or like some beast, grabs Kabuto's other arm, and then Sai punches him in the face. And Kabuto's like, I'm not giving up for Lord Ochimaru. But before even get, getting up, he got attacked by five Ambus. So, five rope Ambus. So one sword just pierces his arm, the other one pierces one of the other arms, and the other two pierces his head, and the last one kind of just pierces, like, his shoulder. And he's like, ah, what the? And the root arm looks like, you are arrested. Kabuto, Lord Chumaru's henchman or whatever, I don't even remember what Kabuto's last name was. So yeah. And, uh, so he was like, ah. And so he picks up the sword and goes back inside. <clears throat> he does tell Lord Donzo that Kabuto is, uh, now arrested and all that. And Lord Donzo was like, thank God, less of a threat later. So, yeah, Kabuto is legit just taken out. Or Chamar is still surviving and all that. Yeah, sort of, tiny bit. <clears throat> and, um,. Naruto, um, no, Hinata and uh, Sasuke were just still hugging and all that. And before, yeah, of course, Kakashi gets hit again. And all the original things happen. Oh, I forgot to mention Kiba versus Naruto. And Kiba was looking at Naruto, kind of just trembling and shaking because Naruto just having a little bit of bloodlust, just smacking, uh, What's the car? K uh K K Cat Wait, what the fuck did I just forget his name? Sorry, I just completely forgot his name. Kiba. Yeah, Kiba. And just keep slapping him with the blood us. And the proctor says, Begin <coughs> Naruto didn't even hesitate to just full on just bitch smack him. <laughs> so he just smacks Kiba off the court and knocking him into a wall and you just see the outline he's not out of the whole wall he just dented in there ah uh, yes i can't remember if i made kiba a good person or bad person but <clears throat> kiba was going after the not and all that and i'm gonna say that no it wasn't naruto it was Sasuke, and he unlocked his shotting gun. His one to two tomoe, and he he went after Kiba, and he well, no wait, he actually unlocked his shotting gun mature instead. So that's what Sasuke did, and then he went after Kiba and easily beat up Kiba, and dented his body into the ground, <coughs> fully knocking him out. So yeah, Sasuke won. Too bad. <coughs> so yeah. <coughs> That's what happens. Um, wait, let me get a drink of one. <coughs> so Air uh Mara then announced that they have a month to prepare and get more new juices and all that. And everyone just leaves. Sas Sasuke leaves with Hinata and all that. Just like having Sasuke's arm around Hinata. And Kakashi was like, he, he got up and he got smacked down again. 
And yeah, Nachi left for like Hana, and Hana had Nachi's arm kind of like healing a little bit. And of course, Nachi's like, yeah, it's fine, Hana. I can just be healed and all that. And Hana was like, I'm sorry, I could have. I could have trained with healing and all that. And now she's like, no, no, no. I'm not. That's fine. So, yeah. Um. <coughs> and, um. What's it called? <sighs> Karnai and, uh. As uh awesome. Why did I say Asta? Asuma. Just kind of left also. And, um. Uh, Naruto and Miku kind of went to Maru and all that. And Sai and Donzo left, and everyone else left, and all that. And uh, Kakashi, he woke up. He's like, oh. he's kind of bleeding from his head. Um, cause yeah, he got smacked the fuck out. He kind of hurts now. He was hurt more than Rock Lee. And that's saying a lot of things. And so when he woke up, he saw uh, Uncle still here. And so Uncle just said, Well, Kakashi, are you okay, Kakashi? And Kakashi says, Do I look okay? And the Uncle says, No, you don't. Well, he, she kind of just like carries uh, Kakashi and says, Well, time to heal you, not that. And Kakashi's like, Unless you're gonna throw me in the forest of death. And Uncle said, No, why would I ever do that? I would never do that to Kakashi Hatake, my supreme leader. And uh, <clears throat> Kakashi like, Uncle, what do you mean? And all that. <clears throat> so, of course, Uncle just takes Kakashi to the hospital. Kakashi's now here and all that. And when Kakashi about to leave, Uncle just jumps on Kakashi and just hugs him and says, are you okay, Kakashi? And Kakashi is kind of blushing because Uncle doesn't have her, uh, her like, top, sort of. And uh, Kakashi just blushing. He's like, what the fuck? He's bleeding and all that. And, um, no, not. She does have her top and all that. And whatever, the fucking fish lane and all that. Kind of hugs Kakashi and all that. And Kakashi isn't bleeding, except for the part where Uncle kind of just kissed him through the through the mask. And Kakashi, said, what are you doing, Uncle? <clears throat> Uncle said, "Well, instead of reading those uh those books, you could be helping me, and we could be having, you know, why not?" And Kakashi's like, "Uh, he's kind of." <clears throat> Tempting at the same time. He's like What the fuck? He's kind of tempting. He's kind of bleeding. He's he's bleeding from the nose. He's having more prepared toss. He's like uh, Yeah, uh, oh, I forgot how old uncle is and Kakashi me search him. Okay, so Kakashi's like 26 to 27 I think so and uncle's like two, She's like two years younger than Kakashi in normal Naruto but in this time, she's 26, and Kakashi is also 26. No, Kakashi is 27, she's 26, and so, yeah. So that's going to happen. And um, he's still going to get absolutely beaten by Obito and Karnai, because Kakashi, Perv, Karnai, Obito, beat the crap out of them, out of him. So, yeah. Um, and this time Naruto is going to go be training and all that. And, um, Mara did tell him about his godfather, and that is Jiraiya. And Jiraiya is doing the same thing, and that is peeking into women. And, yeah. And Miko decides to go train with her family. And, like, the shouting gun and all that. Um... She wanted more fire side juices and all that. So that's why she's in the library training more. And yeah. Uh, what's it called? Hana's doing the same. Now she's still training all that. 
but he can't think how how Ahana smell nice. Like he keeps just thinking of that. That's why uh, Nudgy's not gonna be that great when he goes against Naruto. But yeah, Naruto just Naruto is now just training the Force, but he gets a feeling of a like he feels something different. So he walks towards it, this different thing, and he ends up at a cave. And when he walks in, he meets a a uh, a dragon. He he sees a giant dragon. What's an angel? He sees a dragon, and a uh, dragon. Um, is still sleeping, and Naruto just say, "This is a dragon. They are very rare in this world." So he's not trying to do anything, but he kind of like says, "Hey, Mister Dragon, are you alive?" And the dragon wakes up and he's like, "Huh? Well, human, what are you looking at?" And Naruto just says, "Oh, you are alive. Okay. Um, hello, Mister Dragon." And Dragon's like, "Um, what?" And then Naruto just says, "What is your name, Mister Dragon?" And for just me. Doesn't even know what his name will be because I don't remember Sankari wanting a name for him. So it'll be Shika. The dragon would just be Shika. No, not Shika. Z Zinc. No, not Zinc. Ah. Uh, Zank. Yes. His name will be Zank. Full on just had it to think of a name and all that. Um, sounds like Zachary's, but Zink instead. So that's the dragon thing, beginning. And so Naruto talks with the dragon, and Naruto tells him that his name is Naruto Uzumaki. Uh, Zink was talk telling him about this and that. And so they kind of become good friends. And the dragon does give him a signing contract to, for him to summon him. And so... Zink and um, Naruto both become good friends. And uh, the dragon is going to be called. Zagri I forgot what it was going to be called. But uh, let me go. Let me go find him. Oh, I just noticed that you wanted him to be an egg. Well, the problem is if Naruto has an egg. Dragon years actually works completely different from normal years. So, I kind of changed the egg and all that. Instead, I'm just going to make him, like, not an adult dragon. He's at least teenager year. So, dragon years have be at least 300. Pretty much, yeah. And so, this dragon is black. And, um, yeah. And his name was... The... Well, the nickname you give him was... Okay, the nickname was Black Dragon Uchiha. So that is now his nickname. I will still call him Z Z Z Zink. Zink. I think that's why I call him. No, never mind. Black Dragon Uchiha. That's his nickname. And Naruto just says, Can I call you the Black Dragon Uchiha? And the Black Dragon's like, Sure, why not? And so, he got a summoning contract with the dragon. And that also means, mm. <laughs> oh, uh, that also means he's gonna learn Dragon Sage mode from the dragon. Yes, just what I'm gonna give him that. Also, Naruto, he went to the store before he before he starts training with the dragon to to learn Dragon Sage mode. He went to the store, went to go get some armor. And maybe some armor for the dragon. And uh, the dragon said, uh, "Sure, you can get armor and all that." But the dragon already had armor at like a chest or something because he used to be he used to be helped by an old person that gave him armor and all that just in case he needed it. So yeah, that's why. 
And um, Naruto says, sure, can I see the armor? And it's kind of like gray and all that, like gray. And so Naruto just wanted to go to the spray paint, turn that black. And so he wanted black armor also, so that's why Naruto gets black armor. He gets the same armor type like um, Madara does have. But instead of being red and all that, it's completely black. <laughs> yeah, so Naruto can, like, decide to want to, but at the same time, he doesn't want to ruin his armor yet. So, yeah, he has it. When he goes on missions, he will be on and all that. The dragon will also have black armor. It also reminds me. Pauses. So yeah, yeah. So Naruto has the summon contract, and also when he went to the store and he got like the armor, and black spray paint for it, the dragon's armor. <clears throat> he went next to this uh, to this uh, hot springs, and um, I almost forgot the name. <clears throat> <clears throat> Sorry. Um. Uh, what's it called? He m went to this. Uh, hot springs, and he uh, he saw an old pretty man, and like the roof kind of writing down and all that. This white hair guy, and Naruto didn't like this guy. He being a little uh, weird and pervert, and the only person he thought of was Kakashi. He's like, is that Kakashi? Is that Kakashi? And Kakashi was like, with uncle, and he kind of sneezes like, what the fuck, dude? I feel like someone just talking about me. He's like, I felt like Naruto was talking about me. And he's, and then he just said, nah, never mind. And I'm going say, he's probably t uh, talking about how perverted you are. And Kakashi's like, never. He would never do that. And, um, uh, <clears throat> pretty much. Uh, so Naruto doesn't like how that guy's up there. So he asked the, uh, store guy. I mean, not the store guy. The guy who's having the hot springs and all that. And he says, what was that guy up there, like, peeking in the women? And the guy was like, what do you mean? So he runs out with Naruto. And he sees that old guy. He's like, a perv. So he, he just like, he says, well, I could throw this at him. Or, and Naruto said, I got you, man. So he puts chakra on his arm, grabs a bucket, and throws it at Jiraiya, hitting him. Hitting him into the hot springs. And all the women just look at Jiraiya and just beat his ass. So, of course, Jiraiya is now in, like, bandages. He's like, oh, what the hell was that? Like, because he got hit in the head really hard in the head. Also, Konohamaru was going to the uh, hot springs. And then the pervert closet guy came also. And Naruto saw him. And he says, this is a guy. He says, uh, don't look at the kid. Look at the, uh, guy right there. That guy is a pervert. And the guy was like, is he really? And, and the guy said, I'm not a pervert. I'm a gentleman. The guy looks at Naruto. Naruto looks at him. And Naruto says, complete bullshit. <laughs> and, uh, the store, the store manager just grabs the bucket and throws it at the guy. And just like, think. Go to home. like, yeah, I'm free. <laughs> He's like, big brother Naruto, can you help me, um. Even how they're not brothers, sort of. And he says, can you help me in on walking in water? And so Naruto says, sure, why not? So, yeah. So, that happens. And, um. <clears throat> oh. Okay, so Naruto is right now just. So, Naruto is. Right now, just hmm, training gonna harm her and all that. And then Naruto goes back to the cave, spray paints the armor to be black. And the black dragon likes it. He's like, Yeah, that's actually pretty good. The black dragon with Chiha. And so, uh, Naruto also has black armor and uh, the two swords. And so he takes it off the black armor and all that. And the dragon tells him about Dragon Sage. And yeah, Naruto starts training in Dragon Sage for 20 days, since a month is 30 days or 31 days. 
So, I'm just say 31 days. So, Naruto's playing in Sage, Dragon Sage mode. And, um, right now he has an incomplete version of Dragon Sage mode. So, yeah, it's not fully completely. It still drains a lot of chakra and all that. But he can definitely do Dragon, uh, the summon contract and all that. Uh, the dragon also has Makarama inside, and he just says, Why the fuck is there a giant fox in you? And I just says, I have no fucking clue, but it, it's there. It's there. And, uh, and Karama's like, Hey, I can fucking hear you. And uh, Ashura and Enda are kind of just laughing. Because the dragon did not say a giant fox. He says a giant fur ball in you. And Karama's like, Hey, I'm fucking here. I'm fucking near you. And I'll uh, and, uh, and uh, fucking uh, Ashura and uh, end that I just started laughing. And uh, Karama just, hey, what the fuck are you two laughing at? I am the fucking nine chills. And then that I said, sure, Mr. Fo or Mr. Furbo. <laughs> they started just dying. And Karama just like, shut both of you up. He goes back to sleep. He does not care. Naruto kind of laughs. And, uh, the dragon also laughs and all that. So, yeah. <clears throat> Naruto's training and all that. And Jiraiya goes to Madara. He kind of has, like, just, like, this, uh, what they call it? The thing where, like, they usually have, uh, crotches. I think that's what it's called. And, and Jiraiya kind of just walking. He has one arm bandaged up fully, like, like his elbow because he kind of got broken. And he kind of walks to Madara's office, knocks on the door. Madara says, you can come in. And Madara, and, uh, Madara looks at Jiraiya, and he sees a full-on mummy on. Uh, not mummy. He just sees a full-on mummy. And uh, Madara says, the fuck happened to you? <laughs> Jiraiya says, don't talk to me. He's like, Jiraiya says, okay, I want to talk to you. And, and Jiraiya started talking like, so where's Naruto? Naruto and Mara say, ah, oh, he's probably training. Why? Uh, Jiraiya sits down. He's like, oh, that brat threw a freaking bucket at me. And Mara says, were you peeping on women again? And Jiraiya says, no. I was doing it for research. Ow, my arm. Yeah, when, uh, he just had to put the crutches up and there's that like, arm up and saying, I was doing it for research. And he's like, ow, my arm. Ugh. And, uh, Mara says, Huh. Naruto's pretty smart to doing that. I should probably, uh, I should probably give him a hug. That's good, John. And Jory was like, what do you mean? I got my ass kicked by, like, 50 women in there. Mara just, he just wants to laugh so bad. Because he has these, uh, what's it called? Jirai on this day, and he just wants to start dying and laughing, but he has to be mature. He's like, well, it must have been what you deserve. And Jirai was like, what do you mean, j deserve? I need my research. <clears throat> and so, also, when, um, when Madara and Kushina were kind of dating and all that when they were younger, Jirai kind of did put them in, like, their, like, research book and all that. And, like, their freaking... Jiraiya did the book and all that. And Mara doesn't like that. He's like, well, if I should probably keep Mara away from uh, his girlfriend. And because I swear to God, I think Jiraiya, if he tries to even do the same thing what he did to Mara and uh, Kushina. Except for Mara kicking his ass multiple times. Yeah. And um, Mara is just like, I should probably kick his ass before he even tries. And yeah, <clears throat> Jiraiya does not train Naruto in the, um, the whole freaking, um, somebody, <sighs> oh, sorry, I've been summoning, nah, Naruto doesn't even need it, he has a dragon, and a dragon is pretty freaking tall. He hasn't matured into his age, but he's pretty tall. And Naruto has Dragon Sage mode. 
I must say he finally has Dragon Sage mode. Kind of preferred. Sort of. It's still at like this 90... 90%. Like this 10%. He still has a master it. So 90% he has master it. 10% he has a master it. In the 31 days. So... Naruto just has that. He also been training a physical body, training other juice and all that. So yeah, I know Zachary, you didn't tell me to give him a Dragon Sage mode, but you never said anything about that. So I'm giving him a Dragon Sage mode, and don't worry, instead of like being in the like his eyes being like in the whole toad thing, his eyes he has the shotgun with it. Um, how can I explain it? Um, oh, dang, it's 11 or 2. Um, how can I explain how this is going to work? Naruto, his, when he activates his shotting gun into his internal shotting gun, and he activates the dragon sage mode, uh, the slick eye will still be there. The lizard slick eye and all that will be on there and all that with, like, the shotting gun together. So it would be, like, in the middle. So this part right here, this whole three part and all that, it'd be there, but instead the, um, so, let me, let me try to do this. So the dragon eye would be, like, here. Sort of, I, I probably can't make a dragon eye right now, so, uh, it fucking sucks. So, yeah. So the dragon eye slick there would be there. Of course, the two, uh, so this right here and that and this will still be there. And, um, but the slick eye will be there. Of course, it'll be, uh, what's it called? Black in the middle. But the dot will still be there. Um, the yellow dot and all that. <sighs> How can I explain? So, yeah, that'll be his Dragon Sage mode. And, um,. Yeah, uh, I don't know if you want a different color. If you want it still red, yeah. I was thinking of having it black. Well, like, yeah, just still keep it red. Black and red. Oh, fuck it. Yeah, it'd be like that. Uh, Naruto is still just gonna have it like that. Because he's actually gonna have a glowing effect around him. So, his glowing effect around him is gonna be black. When he's in his Dragon Sage mode. And. He's right now. Pretty freaking OP. When he's in his Dragon Sage mode. He can rival. A. Uh, five Tails and Jerky. That's how powerful it is. His Dragon Sage mode. <clears throat> and if he uses his Dragon Sage mode. With his like. Sh internal shotting guns. And. Uh, all his abilities. Even with the Nine Tails and all that. And Ashran and Indira. He can rival, I, uh, just everyone, everyone in just total. Yeah, that's how over, over, power Naruto is. Sorry, my language, my not language, my words are fucking up now. I'm not tired. I'm just like, what the fuck. So yeah. Also, I just noticed this is a one hour of me talking. Be happy, Zachary. It's a one hour. I'm at least trying to get to, a couple of one hour and thirty minutes. Probably. No promises, though. <clears throat> so, the 31 days are finished. And they go back to the, uh... Oh, let me mention about Sasuke and everyone else. Sasuke has actually been training. And he accidentally stabbed Itachi. Itachi did an illusion just for, uh... Sasuke to walk in his internal shotgun. And when he did that... Uh, Itachi switched his, uh, shotting guns with his. And so, they were completely blind and all that. Well, not blind, they were supposed to get bandaged and all that. So, I forgot who did that. Uh, Hana has working on her, like, Hugo style and all that. Well, also his, uh, shotting gun. Her shotting gun is now the three tomorrow and then went into her internal. And, uh, she didn't know what to do, because... I'm going to say that her mother also had the internal. And so they switched eyes. Well, she didn't have the internal. She had the monocune, but she didn't use it much. And so they switched eyes. And Hana already has her internal. 
Mik no. Miko Uchiha, she only has a three to my own other. I'm sorry, Miko Uchiha. But don't worry. Uh Zachary, can you help me with her like mo internal Monica Shadow will be look like? Don't know if you want it, but I think I have some styles. Um I don't know if you want like something from this because this would be something that I was gonna use later on for a different one. But these are the internal shining guns. So I'm thinking of probably giving one of her, one of it to her. But you can tell me, you can tell me to just Google it to see what it would be. Um. Well, this is sort of what isn't. There's Miko Uchiha's shining gun and internal. There's a shining gun one, and then there's her internal. Don't know if you want that one. I can probably look for another one. My yeah. Ooh. Actually, keeping that later, just just in case I ever actually want to do that for something. So yeah, I actually. Cause. Probably she have an internal. No, just a shining gun. I don't know if you want her to have a. Of course, you want her to have an an uh, internal, but I don't know what kind of type of shotgun gun you want her to have. Oh, that's a very interesting one. Um. So yeah. So, yeah, my wife is kind of being pretty bad, so, uh, yeah, huh, so, yeah, I, you can ask me in the comments what it's gonna look, so, yeah, you can ask me in the comments what you want her to, shining on to look like, I, I think I know what to give, uh, what's called, uh, Hannah's internal shining on to look like, because, she, I'm gonna say that her father was a Hugo member and her mother was a shotgun user. So that's why she gets her uh, Monica shotgun from her mother instead of her father. She gets the uh, Hugo eye from her father instead. So yeah. <clears throat> uh, she's gonna be really strong and uh, yeah. Uh, Hanato's also strong and all that. So, now is the whole, um, tournament, and it's the final exams and all that. And, um, uh, well, this is where I'm gonna end it off, since it's already 11-11. And, yeah. So, yeah, uh, have a nice potato day, potato nights, and potato everything. Put it asleep also.